Right, I'm with Simon, a very happy Simon, after a 3-0 win against Workington. Simon, give us your take on the game. Yeah, well, I thought we took um, our efforts from the Boston second half into tonight's game and did very well. Very well, it was a fresh performance, uh, full of tenacity. I think the intensity was there for all to see and um, really buzzing from it. We needed that three points. And the goals as well. I mean, Liam's second, an absolute pearler. What did you say to him in the dressing room? <laughs> we just said, as a front two, try and stay close together, try and get the balls received into feet, uh, more more football played into the feet of the forwards, um, and when you get on the half turn, go and drive at the centre halves because uh, he's very dangerous. He's right on his game at the minute. And the second goal as well. I mean, obviously it was a back pass to their keeper which he picked up, and uh, but a cracking finish by Craig. Yeah, yeah. I mean. Uh, we're, we're a dangerous proposition when we move the ball about like we are uh, you know, tonight and we've got to do it consistently now. But I thought all over the park uh, uh, we were superb I thought Nelly you know, he's come into his own the last two games in that central area. Uh, he's had a pace and, and, and real will to win and it, it, his goal was fantastic. You know, it's, it's easy to smack it over the bar from that range isn't it but when you're under pressure from a free kick and a wall in front of you but no he finished it very well. How difficult was it for you to pick the team for today? I mean, obviously, like you said, we had a stormy finish against Boston. Was it a case of, you know, it's an easy selection or was it one that you really did have to think about? Didn't have, have much to think about, really. You know, I thought you've got to be consi- I've been consistent with everyone all along, uh, give, giving everyone a lot of game time. And I just felt now it was uh, necessary to, um, you know, we've been five games, five defeats. And yes, we've created a, a, a lot of chances, but we're not uh, taking them. And also, um, we were very sloppy in the first half the other day. Uh, the lights came on, and deserved a starting place. I want to mention Dale Southall. I mean, he didn't get amongst the goals today, but he's playing his hold up and the way he was feeding mm. Liam and the wide players. That must have been very pleasing for you to see. Oh, he's as well. only going to get sharper and sharper. I thought he did well, especially in the second half the other day, and he did well uh, for however long he was on tonight, you know, um, 70 minutes, 75 minutes. Very proud of him. Um, I think he's going to be a, a real talent. You know, he get, does get hold of it very well. And, and tonight, he didn't lose many headers either, did he, from the goal kick? So the, it, it looks a strong lad, but uh, an intelligent footballer. Now we've got another unwanted break with the um, headers for the match being called off. How are you going to keep the lads going? Uh, training, training hard again. Um, Thursday, Saturday. It's a, it's a real shame we haven't got a game, um, but it's one of those things. You know, I wish we'd be still in the FA Cup, but. Uh, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll try and drill the lads, you know, this game plan that we're working on at the minute um, and try and perfect it, you know, it's, uh, it takes a lot of hard work and training and uh, we just want to uh, bank more points up now in the next next few games, try and keep the hammer down like tonight and, and make sure we play with that same um, enthusiasm and intensity. Brilliant, so but it's a well-earned beer now for you. Oh, I don't know about beer, not in my stomach, eh? I'm off home. <laughs> don't blame you, thank you very much, Simon.